Noah Urban, the 19-year-old Flagler County man, accused of stealing at least $800,000 from five different people in a cryptocurrency scheme, was in federal court today. The judge decided to keep him in prison ahead of his March trial. News for Jack's reporter Ariel Schiller tried to speak with Urban's parents as they left court. Mrs. Walk, do you want to comment on your son's charges? Can you comment on your client's charges, ma'am? Noah Urban's parents left the federal courthouse without him Friday afternoon. Cameras were not allowed in the courtroom, but during the hearing, Urban's lawyer called his parents up for questioning. Both said they would be willing to be third-party custodians in the event the judge decided to release him before the trial. Ultimately, the judge decided to grant the government motion to detain Urban, saying he believes Urban is a serious flight risk. He also was concerned about Urban obstructing justice. Urban's charges include eight counts of wire fraud, one count for conspiracy to commit wire fraud, and five counts of aggravated identity theft. The indictment says Urban and others would swap victims' cell phone numbers to phones controlled by Urban and his co-conspirators. The FBI refers to this practice as SIM swapping. The indictment also says Urban and others would reset those victims' account passwords through those phones and then he would transfer funds into his own account. We spoke with Chris Hamer, a cybersecurity expert, about how to tell if your phone has been SIM swapped. You'll either start getting text messages or phone calls from numbers you don't recognize. You'll be unable to make phone calls or send text messages. You'll constantly get no service pop-ups. You'll get service interruptions. Hamer says if you have cryptocurrency, you need to ensure your account is as secure as possible. They need to enable two-factor authentication. They need to not have it remember their credentials and authentication for making transactions. Yes, it slows you down, I'm sorry. But you can either be slowed down or you can have some 19 year old who's smarter than you figure out how to get into your wallet and vacuum it away. In Jacksonville, Ariel Scheller, Channel 4, the local station. If convicted, Urban faces up to 20 years in federal prison for each wire fraud charge.